world hey folks species seven here and welcome back to the channel and welcome back to the maple farm indeed farm sim 22 Alrighty, this is a bit of a tight squeeze but what else is new okay let's hmm Drop the trailer there. I hope. That it actually. I think it did. I think it actually lifted clear of the trailer this time. Good stuff. Now I've got a tractor down here. Hmm. Hope everybody's doing well today. It is the morning of the 28th of March here on the Sunshine Coast of beautiful British Columbia, Canada. Get you lit up. Drop your trailer. And let's see if we can go and get that header trailer out of the way. Somewhere. Somehow. <laughs> oh boy, I tell ya. Lovely. That was a lot less uh, <clears throat> annoying. Now I don't really need to get it that far. I just need to make sure it's well out of the way. There we go. Okay. Much better. Now get this back down to the trailer. Zoop. exactly rolling in the cash are we hmm all right now let's get this going uh, there's a little bit of room on this side still Probably wouldn't kill us to do a single headland here. And at the top. The rest of it's pretty straight. And I think we can uh, get ye old hired worker to uh, make the best of it for us. So, let's uh, start by getting out of there. So that's not going to do us any good. And... All right, that should work rather well. Let's get the machine open. Uh -huh. Lovely. And away we go. Uh, what do we got here? Oh, this is soybean, so it's not going to leave a straw anyway. Good enough. These are nice straight edges. If we can get uh, 
get the top into a dealable condition. We should be pretty, uh, pretty okay. So, there's that. Let's head up top and see what we can do. Uh, I suppose it wouldn't kill us to, uh, collect a strip on the way up, eh? I mean, what the heck, right? I could do the GPS thing, but I don't know that as we're going to hire a worker anyway, it's really necessary. We'll just try and keep a fairly decent edge here if we can. Uh, it looks like it's about right-ish. is going to deal with this field because it, well, it comes to quite a weird point. But we'll let them, uh, we'll let them do it until we realize they can't and then we'll, uh, we'll do what we can do to fix it. Because we do have other projects, so... get down to the bottom and then we'll see how much damage uh, the AI can do for us. <coughs> Indeed. In case their line doesn't quite agree with mine. Alright. Now, um... Hmm. I'm gonna be too late, aren't I? Come on. Yep, I am. Ah, oh, dang. Oh, come on. 
Nope. We've missed the boat. Let's go grab. Looks like our grass fields are going to be ready here in not too distant future. That's kind of nice. Kind of nice indeed. How are we doing here? Lots of fuel. Ooh. Could use some maintenance, that's for sure. Or we end up having a wheel roll off or something. So maybe we'll quickly do that since we're going to be at the farm. Here. Let's get the maintenance done. Can I reach fuel from here? I can. So, let's fill the tank and let's see about getting her maintained, shall we? Uh, repair 7,000. Wow. Well, I thought she was starting to get a little bit, uh, a little bit shaky. There you go. That do explain it. But, we're fully maintained. We got a full tank of gas. And other than a little scrub, which I'm not going to worry about at the moment, I think we're good to go. So, let's grab the big fella here. Oh, come off it. That's just what I needed. <clears throat> I don't imagine. Oh, come on. Trying to stay over to the side so I don't interfere with these freaking cars. And then, of course, it hits everything because it doesn't actually have room on these narrow little roads. Good thing we don't have far to go, and not There we go. So, just basically, what I want is... Crazy there, plow. Okay, I just want to be sort of parallel to the fence here. Might be a bit close, but mm. yeah, it's going to be right about there, actually. So we need to allow to create fields. That should instantly create a field. And hmm, 
I wonder what to... If this will actually work and where he'll put the lines. And much appreciated. Um, okay, I'm gonna lift that back up, I think. It won't let me. Oh, come on. Thank you. Give me B. <coughs> oh, come on. Tell me that's not 15 meters. It's also not going to be in line because the edges of the field don't run this way. Alright, never mind. Um. Let's not bother with that. Let's go back to where we were. Okay. Are we still on allow create fields? I believe we are, yes. Nice. To come along parallel to the edge and Like I said, this is going to become our cornfield. So, once we get this squared up, we're good. Now, I will plow the rest of that upper field. Actually, I might just get a hired fellow to do it. Okay, how we do it? How we do it? Keep going. Are you serious? Gonna go through all the bother of turning it around. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. That is all I needed that for. I mean, like I said, I am going to be plowing the rest of this field, but not at the moment. Okay. 
get off of there. Now, let's get out and grab our trailer. Get that harvester emptied. So that definitely seems to be his current issue. Yeah, he's leaving some weirdness at the end, but like I said, we'll deal with, you know, those sorts of things when it becomes time to deal with those sorts of things. So I'm going to drop that there. Let him carry on. And we'll go up here. No, I don't need create field anymore. So, does that automatically shut off when I jump out or what? Man, you really gotta get in close for that to register, eh? Uh, nope, it does shut off. Good stuff. Good stuff. So... So, this is nice. We're going to have a nice big cornfield. And drop it down. Further, I'd just like it to be able to. Uh, oh crap. All right. So, let's turn you back to allow create fields, drop it down, and then go across here, and we'll knock any trees out of the way that are just going to be too, uh, too much, you know?
All right, are we clear? Or we're clear. All right. Do 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 do. How, uh, uh, let's just carry on here. Be rare a little bit. Ah, damn. I think I'll probably just end up removing them. Okay, harvester still running. Good stuff. We'll still leave some trees down in this area, but for the most part, one more. Nice. And. <laughs> Just about cut the hedge down. There we go. All right. Uh, is that still on? Uh, yeah, let's limit it to fields. Thank you. Alright, away we go. How's that harvester? Uh, he's full. Okay. Let's go get him emptied. Now we're just going to resell that field when we're done with it. So that's going to happen to that. Uh, 
All right. Let's pop you off of there for the moment. fields we're gonna get a decent amount of bean so like I say I don't really have any intention of running this crop on any sort of full-time basis but I didn't see much point in getting uh, the sad little amount we were gonna get either jeez I don't know how much of this he's gonna do uh. back at it yeah I, I think he might just get to the end of this row and stop it's a really sharp peak and they don't tend to like that so we'll see guess uh, this might be the uh, the end of the easies on that one I'm just gonna straighten this out a bit that lines becoming more and more oblique as we go along So yesterday we had the warmest day so far this year with a peak of 14 degrees Celsius. That's uh, that's crazy. That's that's balmy. <laughs> well, you know, compared to uh, the last few months, it is. Even plowed that little patch over there didn't disappear. Weird. Neither does that one. Hmm. You think plowed would pretty much reset everything to their, uh, you know most original of pattern which would be a bare field but it doesn't appear to yeah that's fine we are running a little thin I gotta tell you that though a little thin indeed but like I say we've got a hundred thousand dollar field we're gonna offload here very quickly so, that's going to put the money back in our pocket, and that's why we're so broke. Well, that, you know, radically uncontrolled spending. Yeah. Excellent. Swoosh. Swoosh. And this should do it. And the AI have 
finished their task. Good. That's pretty darn good timing there, AI. Okay, I'm gonna drop you. And I think what we're gonna do here is... Uh, no, that's not what I want. What are you doing, dude? There we go. Okay. Now we are... There's the harvester. There's us. So there's the unit there. Reset. Yes, please. There we are. Avoid all that, uh... Trafficiness. Okay. And we're gonna go and get what we can. That was missed by the AI. So let's do that. Whew. I hope this isn't gonna be a... Is that running? It is. Well, I'm not gonna be long. Um, hmm. This may be another case where we have to uh, run home, empty a silo, and then come back for, you know, our last nine liters of grain. But we'll see how it goes. We don't have a lot in here, so hopefully. Let's go grab all these weird bits. See if we can get her in there. I'd be hoping. Try not to crash the header into the tractor this time. Just, you know, just to be different. Alright, come on. Empty, empty, empty. And, whew, getting a little bit low on fuel. Three, two, oh, you serious? 372 liters. I wasn't off by much, was I? <laughs> Fine. Well, and you are gonna go home with that in you. We're not gonna bother to empty it till we get there, so. There you go. Wait, I didn't pick up the little red dot in time. There it is. If you're wondering what I'm talking about. There are red dots on the trailer. And I assume that... Uh... Oh man, the trailer's the wrong way around. Who thought that was a good idea? Dang it.
but I use them to help me figure out where I want to put the center of my harvester to get the uh, get the uh, header fairly well centered. There we go. I like to aim for that one. Okay. Ah. There you go. No, I can't close the harvester. Can I move that over a little bit? Thank you. And again. Good stuff. Yeah, I see gravity's pulling it down the hill. Oh, come on. Like, I'm sure that would happen with a thousand pound header sitting on it. But so goes. Oh, come on, it went right past the... What a joke, look at this thing. Piss off. Thank you. Unreal. That's purposely making things hard just to make things hard, you know? And I am not a fan of that at all. Yeah, well. It ain't the first time Giants Physics has been our bane. Stopping, so we better not get any more traffic. Oh, God. I can't cut it much lighter than that because I need to be able to get the uh, header through. Yeah, I think this traffic's just a bit much. Mm. It's a little too constant for these narrow roads. <coughs> Excuse me. not a space that I use and it's fairly level here where we're gonna have a trailer oh I had no idea you could do that oh I thought these would only tip to trailers okay no literally I was gonna park it there because we're about to roll a trailer full of grain under it hmm well fine <laughs> I won't complain about that uh, we do need fuel and maintenance, don't we? So, well, fuel at any rate. 
Because that is one thing with this puppy. She is hard on you. And luckily, it's only six, seven hundred bucks to fill her up, I think. Whereas maintenance, as you saw on the tractor, can run into these thousands. And, well, thousands are something that are getting scarce. Hundreds? we still got a few. $521. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Let's uh, put you away. Because we are done with this for, oh, I don't know, the next few months. There you go. Oh. That's still running. <laughs> okay. Look at that. 45,000 liters. That should go well. Yeah, a bit of a hole, even for the uh, 400 horse John Deere. She's feeling the brunt. Oh, yeah. Plowed field. That'll speed you up. Okay, we're off the field, so we will now click the X marks the spot, and we will sell this. $106,000. Oh, it's this one. Yes. Okay. Nice. Now... What is this? Oh, I think that goes with this, doesn't it? Mm-hmm. But we don't actually own that? Oh, that's not good. Yes. We've got facilities sitting on that. <laughs> we kind of need to own it. Um, we own those three. Those are our three grass fields. Awesome. Uh, these two I don't particularly want. And that's likely going to run to some of these as well. Yeah. Yeah. There's our main farm. What are all these things? The tailor shop. Oh, I see. Well, we don't need a tailor shop, that's for sure. She's almost, look at that, eh? That is. Hmm. That's almost crazy. I, uh, that's telling me that those probably should be put together. But, what is uh, in 64? Oh, it's harvested. Everything's harvested, isn't it? Hmm, apparently not. There we are. So it is all plowed and ready to go. Okay. Excellent. Ooh, I should not have stopped on this hill. <laughs> <laughs> no, I should not have. Yikes. Come on. Oh, man. Come on. You can't do it. There you go. A little more. A little more. Yes. There you go. Oh, 
So that field there, right? Hmm. Oh, really? I was waiting for you to go by, you idiot. have a look here. This is basically just an unused chunk of field that we own. Not in great shape. So... Would mean taking some of this out, but I don't really care. Yeah, we may just grab the plow back and turn this into one really large cornfield. Um. Oh, that's right. I'm just gonna say, how is it that I just sold something for a hundred thousand dollars and I've only got eighty-eight? But yeah, we did buy. Uh, buy the other part of that little farm property. Because like I say, we do actually own it, but... Well, we don't own the property, we own the uh, bunch of buildings sitting on it. I don't know how they allowed me to place it. But they did. Okay, here we go. There we are. 45,000 liters of soybeans. And I think that's a good way to end the episode. As uh, I've tended to get a little bit long in the tooth here with some of them lately. So, hope you enjoyed. If you did, you know what to do. Please hit that like button. And uh, that's it. That's the last of the harvests for the year. For the year, indeed. So, take care of each other, folks. And ciao for now.